We're following breaking news that we told you about on daybreak this morning. Four people currently in the hospital following an early morning shooting in downtown Norfolk. And that's where we find Casey Baylor this afternoon. Casey, what have you learned? Well, Ashley, Bethany, Norfolk police say the shooting happened right outside the Legacy Restaurant and Lounge here on East Plume Street. And throughout the morning, we watched as investigators walked up and down East Plume Street combing for clues in this investigation. Just a few minutes ago, we did see them walk inside of the business to gather more evidence surrounding this case. Now, investigators say that this shooting happened around 1.15 this morning. Medics rushed four people shot to the hospital. All are expected to be okay. Now, I spoke with the owner of Granby Waffle Shop right across the street. He tells me Legacy Restaurant and Lounge just opened last month, and he's shocked to hear about a shooting happening so close by to his business. I think it's just sad that it happens in such a nice area. I wouldn't want it to happen to me, no way, or anyone over here. So. And a Norfolk police spokesperson says that a person has been detained. A person of interest has been detained in this case. We're still working to find out what led up to the shooting. For now, live in Norfolk, I'm Casey Baylor for 13 News Now. All right, thanks, Casey. And according to our record, this makes 15 people shot downtown in Norfolk so far this year. And we're going to stay on top of this story for you. Stick with 13 News Now for the latest developments. Don't forget, you can always download that 13 News Now app to have those breaking alerts sent straight to your phone. And this is incident is just the latest in a string of shootings in downtown Norfolk like we've been talking about in recent months. Back in March, there was a shooting outside of Chicho's Pizza backstage on Granby Street that killed three people and hurt two others. Then in April, a shooting inside of MacArthur Center killed one person and injured two others.